Hi there friends, I just felt led to come on here today and do some prayer for healing. Um, just felt like the Lord laid that on my heart this morning, so just being obedient to that. Scripture the Lord gave me was Psalm 30 verse 2, O Lord my God, I cried to you for help and you have healed me. I personally, uh, my own testimony is I have been healed of many ailments that um, I was diagnosed with over the years. And um, I don't have specific moments where um, I can remember, oh yeah, I was healed that day. Um, it was really just <clears throat> as I, um, you know, got closer to the Lord and have stayed with him over the years, um, things have just been healed. And I can't pinpoint a time, like I said, of when. Um, one of those things being narcolepsy. And I know for... Um, at least like the past six years, I have been healed of that. I originally got diagnosed with that when I was 18 years old. And so, um, when I, from, from 18 to about 33 years old, um, it was really hard to function in life. And, um, I just believe, yeah, as, as, um, that scripture, as we prosper, as our soul prospers. And I think a lot of Healing comes when we um, get with the Lord and heal our soul um, of any wounds that the enemy has, you know, caused um, to that he is attached to, to bring these illnesses and sicknesses in our body. Um, I've also been healed of a um, something called interstitial cystitis, and that's as well been um, for at least the past six years. I've had no symptoms Although um, for a few years before that, um, it had been getting healed. And pretty much everything in my body, um, every sickness that I had um, is completely gone. I'm still believing for complete healing of my stomach. Um, I've had stomach problems for a long time and um, they've gotten better and better, but I'm believing for full healing. I've been healed of migraine headaches and just headaches in general and um, just nausea um i've been healed of that so uh, i just i'm a firm believer that when you've experienced healing um you have a special anointing to impart healing for other people because you know the power of god has set you free so um i'm just going to declare the prayer and you know whoever is listening um you know if you attach your faith to those prayers then you can receive from god because really you know we're just the voice it's the holy spirit that um brings the healing and it's Jesus who has all the power in the world to bring the healing. So when we believe that um, that's true and we attach our faith to his power, um, miracles can happen. So I'm just going to be obedient and pray as the Holy Spirit leads here. So Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I just want to lift up everyone who's watching this video. Lord, you know what sickness they have in their body. You know the root cause of it. Lord, you are able to heal them in the mighty name of Jesus. Your word says that Jesus went around healing all that were sick and oppressed of the devil. So I just pray, Father, I pray for sleep disorders to go in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray cancer be shriveled up and die in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I pray for any um, muscle pain to go now in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray spines be realigned in Jesus' mighty name. I pray for headaches to go now in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for sinus issues to, to be healed now in Jesus' name. I declare healing on your head in the mighty name of Jesus. Healing on your body in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for wombs to be healed. I pray that um, many babies would be born um, after their, these wombs have been healed in the mighty name of Jesus. I just declare healing on hands. Um, any arthritis I command to go in Jesus' mighty name. I declare healing on bones, any bone issues, um, any any spine issues. I could declare healing now in Jesus' mighty name. Be healed from the top of your head to the soles of your feet. I pray Holy Spirit fire upon you now from the top of your head to the soles of your feet. I just declare complete restoration. I, I declare healing in organs of the body. Uh, diabetes, go now in Jesus' mighty name. Spirit of infirmity, you've lost your power. I break your power now and I cast you out in Jesus' mighty name. And I just say, Holy Spirit, have your way. 
and whoever is watching this, I pray, Holy Spirit, that you go to them, that you push out all darkness, you push out all sickness, and you just bring complete restoration and healing in Jesus' mighty name. And I just pray, Father, that um, that whoever's heart needs healing, Lord, from any wounds, any any trauma wounds, Lord, I pray. I, pray the blood, precious blood of Jesus over those trauma wounds now. I just pray for healing um, of broken hearts from loss in Jesus' mighty name. And I declare complete restoration over marriages now in Jesus' mighty name. I de declare complete restoration in um, parent-to-child relationships now in Jesus' mighty name. I declare healing over ears right now. Ears open, hear correctly now in Jesus' mighty name. I pray healing over eyes, eyes be restored in Jesus' mighty name. Father, I ask you to open our spiritual eyes and ears to hear what the Spirit is saying to the church in the mighty name of Jesus. I thank you, Father, for hearing this prayer and that it is answered because we come in the name of your precious Son, Jesus Christ, our Redeemer, our Healer, that by his wounds we have been made whole and by his stripes we are healed. Amen. Well, thank you so much for watching this. If you have any prayer requests, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Um, and I will be leaving some scriptures in the description box. So, um, you know, I just believe that, um, you know, once we received our healing um, and then we walk out in our healing, a lot of times the enemy, once we've been healed, the enemy will come to try to... Um, give us those symptoms back and one thing i like to do is um if i'm starting to feel symptoms in my body i just declare the scriptures they have full authority over um what we even see with our physical eyes and feel in our bodies the scriptures have complete authority so i just say by his wounds i am made whole and by his stripes i am healed i carry healing scriptures around with me and i just declare them over and over um, until my body, I tell my body to bow to the name of Jesus and align with heaven. And I tell my body to align with the word of God and that it has full authority. And you know, it, uh, not a lot of times the stuff doesn't go away instantly, but when I keep declaring it, it goes, you know, it builds our faith too, because we start to witness that, um, the scriptures do have final authority and it's our job to exercise that authority and take dominion back. So I just want to encourage anyone who's um, having any illness, sickness in their body or any wounds in their soul or, you know, issues in your relationship just to use the authority of the word of God, declare it out loud and, and um, you know, build yourself up in your most holy of faith by praying in the spirit and, and declaring the word of God and, um, just to keep in worship, keep in Thanksgiving, and just watch what God does. It's so amazing to see, like, once we partner up with the Holy Spirit and um, start believing the Word, how powerful our faith really is when we attach it to the power of the Word of God. So I also just want to say a quick prayer for anyone who's watching this who has not yet received the baptism of the Holy Spirit with evidence of praying in tongues. I just want to um, pray that you would receive. So, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, I just ask for uh, my brothers and sisters who are watching this video, if they have not yet received their prayer language, Lord, I just pray the fire of God upon them now that you would baptize them, Lord, with the power of the Holy Spirit, with the evidence of praying in tongues. Father, I just ask you to send your Holy Spirit and in, in um, power and in fire upon us all right now in Jesus mighty name. Well, thank you so much for watching this again. Um, like I said, feel free to leave a prayer request. I'd love to pray for you. God bless and have an amazing day.